Okay, <clears throat> today we're going to revisit a test that I did before on the MFJ998 on a problem that I've identified before. Uh, and this one has to do with power, maximum power. So the book says that if you try to exceed 1500 watts into the MFJ998, it's supposed to go to bypass mode. Well, it's not supposed to do that anyhow, because bypass mode means open the relays and take the relays out of the circuit. Well, you don't want to do that if you're at 1500 watts. Be that as it may, that function doesn't even work. So when you exceed 1500 watts, what happens is it says uh, overload and starts squawking T and CW QRT, but it does not disable the amp. It does not uh, drop the amp enable or commonly called the push to talk line. And it'll let the amplifier sit there and pump out 1500 watts uh, which could damage the tuner, that's why the feature is there, and plus it's going to let you operate illegally. You don't want to do that. So, uh, MFJ was kind enough to send me a known working chip with uh, firmware 1208.02.01. This came out of a lab machine, uh, 998 that was on the lab, confirmed working. Per spec, uh, I claim it doesn't. So we'll uh, turn it on, I put the chip in, there's the email I got. And we'll turn it on, hold the tune, and then it should go into the versioning number. This is just to verify uh, the 1208.02.01. Uh, incorporate, here we go, version 1208.02.01. There it is again on the top line. Okay, so I'm just going to skip the rest of that self-test, shut it off. And we're going to go straight to... Uh, Straight to the action. So I have a 1500 watt Cantana dummy load, bird watt meter with a uh, what size slug here? I think this is a 2500 watt slug, which means 2500 watts is there. That's 2K, that's 1500 watts there, 1K there. Got the AL82 already tuned up uh, on 80 meters. I'm going to turn on the amp here and uh, make sure it works. I think I have it tuned. So there it is, a 30 watts, 15 watts exciter drive. We'll go 30 watts. And it's putting out about 500 watts. Uh, there's a little inaccuracy with the meters between the MFJ and the bird. That's to be expected, 1600 watts. So what we're going to do now is increase the exciter power until we get this amp to produce 1500 watts. Yeah, you'll see it heading up there. Order 15, and then here we go. Bam, right there. So, ouch, overload. Uh, my amp is still transmitting. And I guess we can call that 1500 watts. Uh, but that's an issue. So, it is not dropping the push to talk line. And obviously, thank God, it's not taking, it's not going into what MFJ calls the bypass mode to open up all the relays and take the tuner out of the line because that would cause a hot switching event arcing. Not a good situation. Uh, to prove that, let's see, that my push to talk line is all working because my foot pedal uh, is dry contact. It goes into the radio in the back of my 890. There's a DIN plug, 8 pin DIN plug. This is push to talk in. And I have it set through the, the menus uh, to activate the relay for push to talk out, another dry contact relay. It's clip leaded over to the amp enable in in the MFJ. And the amp enable out from the MFJ goes over to the relay in on a mighty AL82. We know that works because if I force a retune, and this is by design, a good good design, one of the, the good things about the MFJ998 is when it goes in the tune, it knows to disable the amp. So what we're going to do is just hold the tune, and that should force... Okay, there I'm transmitting. I'm going to hold the tune. You should hear it click. There, you hear? Bang! And it went offline. And, uh, of course, it was complaining that there's too much power. Now it's in a, uh, a bad loop here. I'm not sure why that is. It does that sometime. But anyway, this was just to prove that it has the ability to drop the push to talk line. Uh, there, it actually did a tune event right there. Did you hear? Let's try that again. Hit the tune. Yep, it took it out of line, and it uh, dropped the amp and brought the amp back online again. So, the push-to-talk circuit's actually working. 
What's not happening is the software firmware in here is when I crank up the power. Oops, not the, uh, the microphone pitch is the power here. I can't see. Uh, there goes the power. 12, 15, there. Overload, we're pumping out Buku plate current, Buku power. And it'll stay there until you turn it down. So what is up MFJ? This needs to be addressed.